Are you ready to kickstart an exciting career in one of the most in-demanding fields of technology? In this video, I'll show you how to become a DevOps engineer. A career that blends cutting-edge tools, automation and collaboration to revolutionize how software is built and deployed. Whether you're a complete beginner or looking to level up your skills, I've got you covered. By end of this video, you'll have a step-by-step -step roadmap, insider tips and also all the tools you need to start your DevOps journey with confidence. So, before we begin, make sure to like, share and subscribe. Do not forget to hit the bell icon to stay updated on the latest tech content from Edureka's YouTube channel. Also check out Edureka's DevOps Engineer Master's Program course. The link to the website is in the description box below. Now let's see the agenda for today's video. First, we will explore the significance of DevOps in bridging development and operation, why it is a driving innovation and ensuring faster delivery. Then, we will also learn the core principles of DevOps, its role in automation workflows, and why it's vital for modern IT infrastructure. Next, we'll understand why DevOps expertise is in high demand across industries and how it offers lucrative career opportunities. Then we will also see the skills needed to become a DevOps engineer that discovers the essential technical and soft skills required to excel as a DevOps professional. That is a step-by-step -step guide to mastering DevOps concepts, tools and practices in the coming year. Moving on to the career paths in DevOps, where we'll explore diverse roles and opportunities available in the DevOps domain, from DevOps engineer to cloud architect. I will also share the tips for beginners where you can gain actionable tips to start your DevOps journey, including learning foundational concepts and practical tools. Lastly, I will discuss the future of DevOps in 2024 and beyond, which analyzes upcoming trends and advancements shaping the DevOps landscape for years to come. Have you ever wondered why companies like Netflix or Amazon delivered updates so fast without breaking things? So, why is everyone talking about DevOps as must-have career in tech? Let's find out. First is the high demand, where it is a rapid adoption of cloud technologies and digital transformation initiatives have created a significant demand for DevOps professionals. Then is the lucrative salaries. DevOps engineers command competitive salaries due to their specialized skills and the value they bring to organizations. Next is a continuous learning. The DevOps landscape is constantly evolving, offering opportunities to continuous learning and also skill development. We also have career growth where DevOps roles offer diverse career paths, including Cloud Architect, Site Reliability Engineer, and DevOps Consultant. The last we have is the impactful work. DevOps engineers play a vital role in success of organizations by enabling faster and more reliable software delivery. As technology continues to advance, DevOps will remain a critical discipline by staying updates with latest trends and mastering the necessary tools and skills you can carve a successful career in this dynamic field. Before diving deeper, let's quickly understand what DevOps is and why it's so critical today. DevOps is a combination of development and operations practices aimed at automating and integrating the processes between software development and IT teams. It enables organizations to build, test and release software faster and more reliably. The importance of DevOps lies in its ability to enhance collaboration where it breaks silos between teams, fostering better communication and teamwork. Then is the Accelerate Delivery. Speeds up the software release cycle with continuous integration and continuous deployment. We also have the Improved Quality. It also ensures faster bug detection and resolution through automated testing. Next is the boost scalability, where it enables businesses to handle growing demands with robust infrastructure automation. Last is the ensure reliability. It delivers stable and secure systems with real-time monitoring and incident management. In a world where speed and quality is everything, DevOps transform businesses, making them more agile and competitive. Now let's make this real with an example you can relate to. You're part of a team building a new app. Developers finish writing the code, but now the operation team faces roadblocks deploying it because of miscommunication, manual processes, or infrastructure issues. Do you know what it results to? Delays, frustration, and dissatisfied users. So, that is where DevOps steps in as a game changer here. Think of it as a cultural and technical revolution that connects teams, that is developers and operations collaborate seamlessly, breaking down barriers then which automates workflows, 
where tasks like testing, deployment and scaling happens faster with less effort. Then it also builds confidence. Every release is more stable and reliable because of automated checks and constant monitoring. Last is it drives innovation. By focusing on speed and quality, businesses can experiment, iterate and also deliver better products to customers. It's not just a methodology, it's a secret sauce for delivering value quickly and also continuously in today's fast-paced tech world. In short, DevOps isn't just a buzzword, it's how smart teams win. Now that we know what DevOps is, let's talk about the skyrocketing demand for DevOps professionals in the industry. The content highlights successful DevOps implementation across several prominent organizations, emphasizing how adopting DevOps practices has transformed their software delivery, enhanced collaboration and also boosted overall efficiency. In the case studies from Amazon Web Services, Capital One, GitHub, Slack and the UK Government Digital Service showcase the power of DevOps in real-world applications. Common themes across these organizations include transitioning to microservices architecture, automating processes, fostering cross-functional teams, and leveraging cloud infrastructure. These practices enable faster development cycles, improve operational stability, and allow teams to deliver high-quality services continuously. The key takeaways include the importance of automation, continuous monitoring, and cross-team collaboration. By integrating these DevOps principles, organizations can streamline workflows, scale efficiently, and also respond rapidly to market demands, setting themselves up for sustained success in an increasingly fast-paced technological landscape. Are you curious about what it takes to succeed in DevOps? Let's explore the essential skills you need to master. The technical skills needed are, first is the programming, basics of Python, Bash, or Go. Then comes the OS and networking, that is operating systems where having knowledge of Linux fundamentals, networking protocols, DNS, and firewalls. Next is the CI CD, like Jenkins, GitLab CI, or GitHub Actions. Next is the IAC, tools like Terraform and Ansible. Then we have the cloud computing, like AWS, Azure, or Google Cloud. Have knowledge of containers and orchestrations, like Docker and Kubernetes. The last technical skill is the monitoring and logging, like Prometheus, Grafana, ELK Stack. The soft skills that needed are collaboration with teams, problem-solving mindset, and ability to automate repetitive tasks. Once you have built the right skills, what does your career path in DevOps look like? Let me walk you through it. A DevOps career path is typically involved several stages, each building on technical skills, hands-on experience, and deep understanding of both development and operations. Here is an overview of the typical DevOps career progression. We have three levels. The first level is the entry level, then is the intermediate level, and the last is the senior level. In the entry level, we have roles like DevOps engineer, junior DevOps engineer. And in the intermediate level, we have DevOps specialist and DevOps analyst. Last in the senior level, we have DevOps architect and then the DevOps lead. Now let's see the salary prospects of DevOps engineer. The average annual salary in India for the entry level is 3 to 5 lakh per year. And in the mid-level, it is 8 to 14 lakh per year. And moving on to the senior level, it is 18 to 30 lakh per year. Similarly, let's see the average annual salary in US for the DevOps engineer. For the entry level, it is $66,000 per year. For the mid-level, it is $100,000 per year. And lastly, for the senior level, it is $166,000 per year. Starting out can feel overwhelming. But don't worry. I've got some practical tips to help you kick off your journey. Building a strong foundation in DevOps. Let me take you to a step-by-step -step guide. First, start with the basics. In basics, we have first is version control, where master git, the industry standard for version control, learn basic commands like git init, git clone, git add, git commit, and even git push and pull. Next, we have is the command line. Become proficient in using the command line especially in Linux or macOS environments. This will be crucial for working with DevOps tools. The next step we have is dive into DevOps tools. In that, we have first is choose a CI CD tool. Start with the popular tools like Jenkins, GitLab CI CD, or Circle CI. Learn how to create pipelines, automate builds, test, and deployments. Then is learn containerization. Understand Docker and Kubernetes, 
practice building Docker images and deploying them to Kubernetes clusters. Next is Explore Configuration Management. Learn a tool like Ansible, Puppet or Chef to automate infrastructure provisioning and configuration. Last is the Cloud Platforms. Gain hands-on experience with cloud platforms like AWS, Azure or GCP. Learn how to provision and manage resources using their APIs or CLI tools. The next step is build a strong portfolio. Under that, we have first is personal projects. Create small DevOps projects to showcase your skills. Then, open source contributions. Contribute to open source projects to gain real-world experience and learn from others. Last is a GitHub profile. Maintain an active GitHub profile with well-documented projects and contributions. Here we have the next step, that is continuous learning. Under that, the first is the online courses. Learn from the online courses platforms which offer a wide range of DevOps courses. Next, we have tutorials and documentations. Refer to official documentations and tutorials for tools you're learning. Last is DevOps communities. Join online communities like Reddit, Stack Overflow or DevOps forums to connect with other professionals and learn from their experiences. The last we have the certification. The DevOps certification adds a credibility tag to your skills making a job search very potent. It means higher salary and career growth, with the added advantage of being updated at all times on the current tools and best practices. Certification does not stand as only way, but it gives a huge advantage in the job market. You can also check out our Edureka course DevOps Engineer Master's program that will give you a proficient in DevOps principles like CD, continuous monitoring and continuous delivery using tools like Puppet, Chef, Docker, Git, and Jenkins. It includes training on Linux, Python, Docker, AWS DevOps, DevOps Engineer Certification Training Course Curriculum created by extensive research on 5,000 plus job descriptions across the globe to make you a certified DevOps expert. Remember, the key to success in DevOps is continuous learning and practice. Stay updated with the latest trends and technologies, and always be curious to explore new tools and techniques. Let's look ahead. What does the future of DevOps hold? And why should you jump on this exciting career path now? The future of DevOps in 2024 and beyond is set to evolve with the following key trends. First is the increased automation. DevOps will automate more complex tasks like testing, security checks, and system monitoring. This will streamline processes, reduce human error, and also speed up the software delivery pipeline. Then is the AI and ML integration. Artificial intelligence and machine learning will help DevOps teams by providing predictive analysis and also automated issue detection. AI-driven tools will optimize deployments and provide insights that lead to more efficient operations. Then we have the shift left testing. Testing will continue to move earlier in the development lifecycle, ensuring bugs are caught early. This reduces risks and also accelerates release cycles by embedding continuous testing into CI-CD pipelines. Next, we have the DevSecOps. Security will be integrated at every stage of the development cycle, from planning to deployment. Using DevSecOps, this approach automates security checks and ensures that software is both fast and secure, addressing the growing need for secure software development. Next, we have the cloud-native and serverless architectures. The use of cloud-native technologies and serverless computing will grow. These approaches reduce infrastructure management, allowing teams to focus on code development and also faster deployments without worrying about underlying infrastructure. Then we have cross-functional teams. Collaboration will be further emphasized, with cross-functional teams like development, operations and security working together to deliver software quickly. Breaking down silos between the departments will lead to faster decision-making and improved outcomes. Next is self-healing systems. Systems will evolve to be more resilient with self-healing capabilities. These systems will automatically detect and resolve issues, reducing downtime and to the need of manual intervention. Next, we have is the edge computing. With the rise of edge computing, DevOps will adapt to manage distributed systems at the edge. This enables faster data processing and improve performance for applications that need to run closer to end users. Then we have the enhanced monitoring and observability. As systems become more complex, advanced monitoring tools will be essential. Real-time observability will help DevOps teams track system performance, security, and the user experience, 
enabling faster issue resolution. The last is the talent and skills development. As the demand for DevOps continues to grow, there will be a significant need for skilled professionals. The role of the DevOps engineer will evolve to require expertise in automation, security and cloud technologies and AI, driving organizations to invest in training and also development. Now that you have a clear roadmap to becoming a DevOps engineer, let's wrap things up with some final thoughts to help you take the first step confidently. In conclusion, the path of becoming a successful DevOps engineer is a dynamic journey that combines technical expertise, automation and also cross-functional collaboration. As the demand for DevOps professionals continues to grow, driven by the rapid adoption of cloud technologies and digital transformation, the career offers not only lucrative opportunities but also continuous learning and career advancements. Key concepts like CI-CD, Cloud computing, containerization, and DevSecOps form the foundation of the DevOps engineer skill set. Following a structured roadmap, starting with learning the basics and advancing to hands on practice with tools and certifications, will prepare you for diverse career paths in this field, from the junior engineer to DevOps architect. Looking ahead, DevOps will continue to evolve with trends like AI and ML integration, self healing systems, and edge computing ensuring that DevOps engineer will remain at the forefront of technological innovation. To succeed, DevOps professional must embrace continuous learning, gain practical experience, and stay updated on the latest tools and trends shaping the industry. By mastering the necessary tools and skills, aspiring DevOps engineer can build a fulfilling and impactful career in one of the most exciting fields in tech. With this, we have come to an end to this video on how to become a DevOps engineer. If you have enjoyed listening to this video, please be kind enough to like it. And you can comment on any doubts and queries. We will reply to them as soon as possible. Do look up for more videos and playlists and subscribe to Edureka's YouTube channel to learn more. Thank you for watching and happy learning.